In grade one, students talked about how Earth Day connects to ways of making improvement in how we organise ourselves. We can reuse, recycle, reduce, rot, re-gift, repair or refuse. Each student created a tie-dyed handkerchief which they can use at school to wipe their hands or wipe down their desks as a way of reducing their paper towel usage. Grade 2 walked to the canal near school. They used their observational skills to sketch and label what they noticed about this particular habitat and microhabitats. Students considered what would harm or help this habitat. They decided to take plastic bags and were excited to collect rubbish while out on their walk. As part of our Earth Day celebration, Grey Tree converted used pet bottles into flower beds. Go ahead. There are a lot of sprouts because the, the eggs don't help. help the soil and uh, get, give them like a pe healthy. Uh, and because of the rain and the sunlight, it um, yeah. makes them grow. And we give uh, water each day when it, the rain, rain doesn't come. Grade 4 planted sunflower seeds in biodegradable pots to encourage pollinations. Lisa, can you tell me what you're doing here today? We're watering the sunflower seeds. Great. Go ahead. The Grade 5 Environmental Leadership Group has been working on encouraging students and faculty in the elementary school to reduce paper towel usage when washing hands. They have made videos and signs, visited classrooms and assemblies and have sent out surveys. They are still collecting data to see how impactful their message has been. Oh no, I forgot my handkerchief. What am I going to do? Put your extra handkerchief in your backpack. I have an extra from my backpack. How do I use a handkerchief? Do you use it to blow your nose? <coughs> you use it to wipe your hands. Remember to put it out before you wash your hands. This poster will remind you to bring your handkerchief. Remember to put your handkerchief in your pocket. In elementary art, Students decorated bamboo spoons and noted one small change which they could make to their daily life to help protect the environment. A younger students enjoyed reading Todd's pa Todd Parr's The Earth Book to gain some inspiration. Grade twos are pictured here, planning their ideas and decorating their spoons. Suggestions range from planting seeds with my little sister, to remind mum to take her reusable shopping bag, from riding my bike to school two times a week, to remind dad to close the refrigerator door. The idea of teaspoons of change is that when everyone works together to make a small change, we can make a big impact on the environment. <laughs> 